Hey guys, it's Ryan Fitcher doing another video. Certainly taking a look at the Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Foot Soldier figure. So, um, this is an, a little bit of an older figure. It came out uh, with the first wave. So, as you guys can see in the back, there's only Leonardo, Donatello, Raphael, Michelangelo, original Shredder, uh, Krang, Foot Soldier, Splinter, and April O'Neil. So, yeah, that's why it's a little bit of an original kind of figure because the newer series, if you got a box on the back, you can see there's more figures now. So, um, that's something too. But really, uh, basic packaging for the Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles line. It's got the uh, logo, green and yellow in the back, and purple. Uh, Foot Soldier, the evil ninja loyal to the shredder. Um, to the, yeah, the shredder. Um, on the back, it shows the uh, bio, and it shows his weapons, a, tr a traditional ninja weapons, and he, his team is the Foot Clan. So, it's also got the regular feel about the uh, turtles and how they became the turtles. So, yeah, that's really just the packaging. Um, Alright, so... Let's get this guy open and see if he's any good. So now I've got him out of the packaging, so first let's get his accessories out of the way. So um, first he comes with his sheath for his two swords. Um, so he comes with this little knife. Really cool. And also he does come with a sword. So yeah, he comes with also two throwing stars. So he does come with about five accessories. So um, yeah, let me put his sheath back on. So yeah, not bad. Um... It's a little, as you guys can see, it's a, a foot soldier, so there's really not much to it. Um, he does stand really nicely, except for he is always in a battle-ready pose, so you have to stand him on his toe. So, he'll be always with, like, that. So that's a little bit of a pain. But, um, also, this is a, just a defect on mine, but you guys can't see it, but there's a lot of paint missing on this side of the eyes, which is the red part. And it's just missing, which kind of sucks, but I can probably fix that if I wanted to. But detail-wise, not bad. Um, he's always stuck in a battle ready pose, so it's going to be a problem. Um, but um, as you guys can always see, this if you always see this guy, you always know this is a foot soldier. So um, he's got the foot logo on the top, which looks really cool. He's got the mask, which looks really awesome. Um, he does have uh, some detail there, and that's really it, basically. It's just a foot soldier. But for articulation, the head can go 360 degrees. I it looks up just a little, not not much. The arms move in and out, and then the arm or the wrist or no, the bicep swivel right there, not bicep, um, like elbow, like part where it hits the elbow, something like that. Um, uh, waist moves, the leg moves, um, in and out, backwards and stuff, and that's it. So um, not much for articulation, which kind of sucks, but um. Still not bad. Oh, wait, it's wrist, wrist articulation, too. I did not know that. Um, so let's put his stuff back in his sheath and stuff. And let's see if he can actually hold a ninja star. I think he can. Yep. So um, that's really cool. Got him in a battle-ready pose. And, um, yeah, so not bad figure, honestly. Um, if you put him next to Shredder, like him as a soldier, it looks really cool. Actually, that looks really nice. It, they fit in really well together, so it's really awesome. So, yeah, so it's awesome when you get to see the ninja, or the foot soldier, fit in with their um, main character. So I'm happy about that, like their leader. So, yeah, not bad figure. Very, very limited in what you can do with him, but still not bad at all. Um, if you have Shredder, it's really cool, and you, um, you should really get the... Uh, foot soldier, you, and the best part is you can get as many as you want. It's an army builder like the crank. But I honestly think I'm gonna get one more. I honestly just think two would be great to go um, next to Shredder, and I think a cr uh, maybe three crank would be fine. And also, there's a uh, robo robot uh, ninja coming out soon, which maybe is on the pamphlet. Let me check and see. Because if you didn't know, in the t uh, bottom of the box, each uh, thing, each turtle comes with a pamphlet. Let's see what's in here, because maybe they'll show the turtle, I don't know, um, because this is one of the newer ones, I think this one came with Casey's, uh, Casey Jones, um, is he in there, I don't see him, they show the new figures, which is, uh, Slash and Tiger Claw, and, uh, I think, um, who else is in that, uh, oh, the Neutralizer, so, um, they don't, I don't, know. they don't show, oh yeah, there it is, right there. Um, there's the robotic crane, so I might pick two of those up, maybe, because that's all I really need, because then I have, uh, four, uh, foot soldiers with, uh, shredder, so it's basically just a, t a team of five. So, um, yeah, not bad figure, um, it looks really good with shredder, so if you have a shredder figure, I decide, you should decide to pick it up, and also if 
you have the turtles and you want to do some ACBA shots, it'd be really suggested to um, get Shredder, I know, Shredder and the Foot Soldier because then you can have the turtles fighting and why would you want to um, make a uh, ACBA shot of them not fighting because it's epic, of course. So, um, yeah, not bad figure. Um, if you have the Shredder, highly suggest picking it up. If you don't, you don't need it, honestly. But if you do have Shredder, you need his henchmen. So, um, yeah, so like all the evil guys and the sh um, henchmen. So that'd be, um, that's a great thing to do with your uh, figures. So, um, yeah, so um, basically, an, a, again, another hit or miss. It's either if you don't have Shredder, don't get it. And if you don't have Shredder, don't get it. If you have Shredder, you should pick it up because it looks great with him. So, um, as you can see, he looks awesome with him. Yeah, because his little henchmen. I could probably get a little better pose with him, but still. Really great looking figure. Um, looks, it's one of my, um, actually this look is one of my favorite for the foot soldiers, honestly. But, um, yeah, so, again, it's another hit or miss. Either you get it if you have Shredder. If you don't have Shredder, it's a, uh, you don't need to. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to give it, like, oh, I'm just going to say, yeah, I'm going to give it a 3.5 out of 5. I'm just going to start doing numbers, maybe. If you guys want me to start reading it the 1 to 5, let me know. But, um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more reviews, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.